This is a short clip from today's podcast episode. You were talking about tools to do the job properly earlier. Mm -hmm. So can you mention a few of those that uh, people are using to their improve their booking rates? I can jump on that one. I love tools. That's my jam. I'm a big systems and process person, and I love utilizing tools to empower the CSR. Remember, when that phone rings, I mean, the first thing is brain and eyes, mouth, ears, hands, heart, everything is fully engaged in that phone call when the customer calls your business. And so to support the CSR in a way that makes sense, while all of those senses are already engaged in the phone call and they're connecting to that homeowner, we really want to make those access accessible to them and easy to see and find. And so if you come to the uh, CSR Academy event in person, we're going to teach you how to build a digital representation of all the information that you need in an effort to, I don't know, dare I say clone yourself, in an effort to scale yourself. Um, and so that's going to be really cool because that often can be a place where people bump their head in their customer service. If they do need to scale, it can be awfully painful to bring in a new individual. Somebody in the in the business has always got all that great collateral material in their head. And if they quit or get sick or have a baby or something happens in their life and they walk out with all that information, how can we as business owners sort of build against that reality? Because they may leave. I mean, that's just a reality of what we do as business owners. And so we're going to build something in the academy that's going to keep that from being as painful as it can be. Nice. Nice. So you're helping them develop systems, SOPs, get it in writing, A to Z, taking impact or input from the CSRs themselves, helping them create that. Yes? Yep. Absolutely. How to download all that incredible information that they already have and put it in a place where it can be scalable and reachable. Yeah. Now let's talk about why training CSRs are so important. So, you know, as uh, Angie had said earlier, Now I'm mixing up in my old brain what was before the recording and what was after. But uh, we were talking about booking rates being, you know, in the 30 and 40 percent, right? And then when you're done with training, we're getting in 70, 80, 90. So can you can you speak to the booking rates that you you're encountering and how you help them grow that? Yeah, absolutely. I we were speaking earlier a little bit about how at one point it was very hard to measure booking rates. We just didn't have sophisticated enough software to do that. And since I have been on Service Titan, which is my full-time job right now, it's been so much easier to track booking rates. Uh, You know, the calls are recorded. It's easier to go back and listen to calls and find out why calls were not booked. Mm. So much more technology now to help us really improve the call experience, improve what CSRs are doing because we can listen to those calls. We can track and measure their performance. Now we have AI to help us do a lot of that as well. So there are so many tools available. A couple of years ago, we were pulling some data at Service Titan just to get a good idea of where the booking rates were. And we were really surprised to see 42% was the booking rate. Now this, this was a number that shocked me because at my company, I'm the owner. And so I know how much money I'm spending on marketing. I know what I'm putting out there and I want to optimize every single marketing dollar, stretch it as far as I can. So I know the more calls that I can book without having to spend more money, the better. And if I can provide an amazing experience where my customers are now referring us and we're getting referrals that don't cost me any money, that makes it even better. So now I'm really compounding my marketing dollar with providing a great experience. So that was something I really focused on. So I could keep my marketing budget low, provide a great customer experience, have very high booking rates, now get referrals. It's just, it was a machine and and we were constantly over 90% booking rates. And so it was something that was really important to me. And when other companies saw this, this they were like, Angie, teach us how you're doing it. What are you doing? And it, it came down to, we talk about scripts a lot in CSR world, right? What scripts work. But for me, it's more than a script. It's a process, a process of building trust with your customer, a process of asking the right questions. What questions, what information are you gathering? Because once you know more about the situation, you can get the right technician on the call. 
that can really optimize and maximize that call, convert it into a lead if possible. So it's gathering that information so that the rest of your team can work its magic. And and by building that experience, using the right words, a a level of psychology, if you will, with word choice, building value on the call. There are so many things we can teach CSRs to do to really impress that customer, provide an amazing experience, and really be a great representative of the company. We have, as business owners, we are hiring someone to represent our company. And if we're not pouring into them, what is going out of their mouth? Like, how are they representing your brand, your name, your company? As a business owner, this is somewhere I invested heavily in. That was my main focus. And now it's something I focus on as Service Titan as well. And I'm excited to come with Erica and Michelle and really bring all of our background and experience to just pour.